Hi everyone, Happy New Year and welcome to my YouTube tutorial channel where I'm going to give this cute uh, little lantern that I found, I actually found three of them and I'm going to give them a quick makeover. So here uh, what I'm doing is just removing the screws from the bottom because I just want to check it out and make sure everything is in working order. So as you can see, it, on the corner of the lantern, it's actually snapped, broken. So I'm just going to repair that uh, just by using some uh, painter's tape, masking tape. And once I paint that, you won't even notice that the crack is there. So I'm just adding a few layers of the tape on this broken corner piece and just to make it a little bit thicker. So now that's done, as you can see on the corner there, I'm just going to use some cacao colour chalk paint and just give this one coat. See, chalk paint is very good and it just covers up everything and it dries very quickly as well. I'm actually going to use a, a hairdryer to dry off the paint, make sure it's dry uh, once I've given the lantern uh, one coat. I'm using downward brush strokes and that way it will make it look like wood at the finished result. So just the top you brush to the sides but the rest you do in a um, downwards brush stroke. So once my lantern has completely been covered, I'm just going to give this lantern one coat, it doesn't need any more. The chalk paint, I added a little bit of water and it goes a long way. And then I'm just going to use my hair dryer to make sure the lantern is completely dry with the chalk paint. So now that it's dry, I'm just going to dip my brush into some dark wax and just dry brushing some of the dark wax onto the lantern and catching some of the corners, the edges and in the downwards brush strokes and this will make the lantern look like wood. Don't go too mad on the wax, you just literally uh, want to just cover the chalk paint but not too much. So you want to leave some of the chalk paint exposed. So once that's dry,
I will go ahead and uh, dry that off with my hair dryer as well just to make sure that the wax is dried. Put all the screws back in, gave the glass a good clean and now we're ready for the uh, third stage which will be some lines. So I'm just going to draw some lines with uh, a bamboo popsicle stick just to give me some straight lines and it gives me a good width because I want this lantern to look as if it's uh, wood and I'm just using a pencil, just a regular pencil to draw my lines. And then go over it with a bit of the wax from your brush just to dull the lines slightly. And you don't want the lines to be too straight because wood is not very straight, so you want it to be a little bit skewed. See, it looks like this and again just going over with my dark wax brush and now I'm just using the uh, bam, sorry the um, popsicle stick and just scratching some of the corners and the edges of the lantern you can use sandpaper I just happen to have the popsicle stick and that just did the job and now I'm just sticking some um, uh, stickers they look like snowflakes on the uh, lantern just to give it the winter theme but you can remove them um, if you then want to use it for a uh, Christmas decor or anything like that you can add whatever you like I'm um, doing winter theme at the moment so I'm just using some of those snowflake stickers that I have and you'll be seeing a lot of these in my videos because I've bought quite a few and um, I think they're really good for crafting and here now I'm using some white wax I'm just drawing some more lines on the back of the lantern which I forgot And then just going over with a little bit of white wax just to age it and it will make it look like uh, wood. So if you're enjoying this video uh, please give me a thumbs up and a like, leave your comments below and don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you want to see some more of my videos. I hope you enjoyed this simple tutorial and you can do this with any type of of um, ornaments that you have at home and use this method it comes out so super cute and it looks like wood uh, using the techniques that I've showed you here like this in my video so enjoy and I hope to see you again soon bye